This is a Windows Phone 7 app review of Flux, which is a Google News Reader for Windows Phone 7. And this app is available in the marketplace for free if you download the free trial, which is the full version, or for $1.99. So the app actually has image caching there, which you see it's loading and it's caching the images. So images actually come up even faster than other apps. And so you can view all of your news right there in the All view. You can also look at the Unread or the Starred categories. And it all loads really fast thanks to all the caching that the app does. And it has the live tile on the home screen as you see, which actually will flip over when you have new items, like it should flip right now. There we go. So it shows that. And it also shows your current count, and the live tile is extremely accurate. And loading the app is really quick. While this loading, you can still open up here and start looking at your old articles even before the um, syncing finishes. So it all works really well and it's really fluid. And then when you view items, you have three different view options and you can set the default view option in the settings. The mobilized view, which is right here, and that uses the mobilizer view. So you can view the article in a really nice format, but you can't view comments. So that's where the original view comes in handy, over there. And unfortunately you can't swipe between these. Or actually you can if you drag from the very edge. Never mind. So you can swipe between those. So you'd have to look at the original to view comments, which on some pages can be a little slow. And then you also have the preview mode, which just shows you the very first snippet of text from it. So you can change all your settings in the app settings and pick which one is opened on default. And you can also mark it as keep on red and you can instantly go to the next item too. So overall it's a really nice interface and easy to use, has all the features you could want like adding favorites, you can mark items as unread there, open an internet explorer, you can do practically everything with the app. You can instantly mark everything as red just by checking that check mark, and it marks them all as red. So overall the app is really good and it's got a pretty good interface. The only real complaint I have about it is that the title at the top gets cut off by that status bar there, and so it's kind of tough to hit the top ones because half the view is cut off there, and the text overlays, which is kind of annoying, but that's really my only complaint with this app, and since it's completely free, you might as well download it and see if you like it any more than your previous um, Google News viewer. It definitely has one of the fastest interfaces, and it's really fast for jumping into what you want to look at. And the What's New view automatically populates with the new items, so if you don't have any unread things, then that won't show up. You can even change the screen rotation settings, what page the app opens in, what browse mode you want to view in, and all the reading font size, etc. There's tons of apps to play around with, even the caching and the live tiles, which will be updated about every 30 minutes. So overall, you should check out Flux in the marketplace for $0.99 cents or for free.